Welcome to the Dentamax Tip of the Week. Today I'm going to show you how to enter in default information into Dentamax, which is a tremendous, huge time saver. Let me show you what I mean. The first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to click on File here in the upper left-hand corner of my screen and go down to Program Preferences. Okay? I live here in Mesa, Arizona, and so nine times out of ten, when we see a new patient, the area code is 480. So I'm going to enter that in as my default area code. Next thing I'm going to do is click on Data Settings. Okay, here at the top of my screen, I'll click on Data Settings. And then from here, I can select my default provider. Okay, in my office, we have four providers. But Juan Sanchez is the one that we see nine times out of ten for new patients. So I'm going to select him as the default provider. If you are a single provider office, please use this, take advantage of this feature. Huge time saver. Rather than having to enter in that provider every time when you add a new patient record, it will automatically pop in if you have selected your provider here as your default provider. Okay. Um, now we have other default settings we can play with. Um, in my practice, uh, let's just uh, say that we are a pediatric dental office, so I might want to select default primary teeth for all patients. We're using the full version of Dentamax with a charting screen, and I want it to default to primary teeth, so I'll select that. We'll click on Save Changes. Now let's go ahead and add some additional default settings for our new patient records. To do this, we'll click on Patients here at the top of our screen. We'll click on New Patients on the left-hand side. And uh, in Arizona, um, usually when people come into the practice from the, from the great state of Arizona, we have a lot of winter visitors, and so uh, we can always overwrite that. But we're going to make Arizona our default settings. I'll put AZ there. You need to click on a different fill to save this, and uh, you, you will then click on Use This Data for New Patients here at the bottom left-hand side of your screen. program will ask you, are you sure you want to use this as your default settings for all new patients? And the answer is, yes, I do. We'll click on Yes, click on OK, and let's go ahead and try it out and see if it works. So we get a new patient that comes into our practice. We'll click on Patients here at the top of our screen, click on New Patient, and um, let's go ahead and make one up. So let's go ahead and we'll type in Smith and we'll type in um, maybe Jerry Smith. Here we go. Uh, we'll kind of skip through here. Uh, state, it says Arizona, pops in automatically. Um, let's say phone number. If I just type in a regular phone, try this again without an area code, guess what happens? Area code automatically pops in. Try that out again. Works on all of them. Huge time saver there. You can see that Juan Sanchez pops in as our assigned provider. Let's go ahead and we'll save this partial information for our new patient record for Jerry Smith. And let's go ahead and pull Jerry back up again. We'll look him up by his first name. We'll pop on over to his charting screen and yay! It shows the primary teeth. Well, this has been your Dentamax tip of the week. I hope you've enjoyed it. And I look forward to next week. Thank you.